हेलो चिल्ड्रेन वेलकम बैक टू नागेश करजगी और किड्स स्कूल चैनल शोलापुर आई निकिता टीचर टीचिंग यू सोशल स्टडीज फॉर ग्रेड थ्री येस चिल्ड्रन इन द लास्ट सेशन वॉट वी हैव लर्न या वी हैव लर्न अबाउट लेसन नंबर सेवन कोलकाता इन द प्रीवियस सेशन वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट सम प्रेजेंटेशन एनिमेशन एंड क्वेश्चन आंसर्स येस चिल्ड्रन and i have gave you the homework yes children i have told you to read lesson number 7 and even to learn hard words yes again i have given one more homework that you have to try to solve textbook exercises have you done okay if you have done let's check the answer is correct or wrong okay now what in today's session what we are going to do we are going to solve textbook uh, textbook exercise and enrichment activity now before starting uh, the session i i request all of you to take your pencil eraser sharpener and your textbook okay i will give a second to take out your materials until that time you have to open page number 40 4040 okay children are you ready with your materials okay let's start with the textbook exercise take out page number 40 take out page number 40 40 yes children first question is what match the columns first question is match the columns number 1 what they have gave airport they have give two columns one this one and this one let's see number one column airport number one is airport two is bridge number three is railway station number four is river number five is sweet next see the other column a1 is sandish b hubli c netaji subhas chandra bose d howra and e rabindra setu okay let's see the match the column number 1 airport yes children tell me what will be the correct answer airport is named as yes netaji subhash chandra bose yes children write here number 1 even you can write the number 1 or you even you can match the answer number 2 is bridge yeah what is the name of the bridge yes children yeah where is the bridge yes rabindra setu yes number 3 is what children railway station yeah where is the what is the name railway station yes that is howra right here number 3 as well as you can match the answer okay number 4 is what river river what will be the answer river hugli right here number 4 yes or either you can match the answer number 5 is what sweet sandish what is the answer last answer is a and you can write here number 5 yes children done okay let's see next question that is b1 answer the following questions yes number is number 1 is what describe the climate of kolkata yes children come on give me the answer how is the climate in kolkata yes children yes who will give me the answer yes kolkata is near the sea coast so the weather remains moderate throughout the year during the monsoon month of june to september it rains very heavily as you know the climate of kolkata is moderate climate yes during monsoon months of june to september it rains 
heavily yes children let's see the next question that is name three places of tourist interest in kolkata yes children as we have discussed so many tourist interest places in kolkata but you have to write here only three places whichever you like to write you can write you can see you can write fort william victoria memorial or alipur zoo even we have seen so many beautiful places attraction that is uh, national library science city kaligarh these are so many tourist interest in kolkata yes let's see number 3 question what clothes do the men and women of kolkata usually wear yes children give me the answer what type of clothes do the men men and women of kolkata usually wear yes children who will give me the answer yes the traditional clothes of the men are dhoti kurta or pyjama kurta but in recent times it has changed to trousers and shorts the women wear sari and salwar kameez yes children next see next question we'll see that is number 4 write a few sentences about the transport facilities in kolkata now you are going to give me the answer that you are going to say some few sentence about the transport facilities in kolkata yes children give me the answer yes kolkata was the first city to have the metro or underground railway system it also has trains and double decker buses yes children next question that is number 5 what are the major industries found in kolkata what are the major industries found in kolkata yes children give me the answer yes the major industries of kolkata are chemical jute textile rubber rice and paper these are the major industries found in kolkata yes children understood okay now i will erase this question now take out the next page yes take out the next page now let's see the next question yes that is multiple choice question multiple choice question that is number 1 kolkata was earlier known as options are a kolkata kolkata b kalikatta or c kaligarh yes come on children give me the correct answer what is the kolkata was earlier known as yes correct option a that is kolkata okay number 2 the people of kolkata speak which language the people speak in kolkata options are a punjabi b bengali c marathi yes children the people of kolkata speak is it punjabi no bengali yes answer correct answer is what bengali very good children that is number 3 the main festival of kolkata is yes children let's see the option a one holi b one diwali c one durga puja though kolkata is celebrating all the festivals yes kolkata though kolkata is celebrating all the festival but the main festival of kolkata is which which is the main festival of kolkata they are celebrating yes holi diwali durga puja yes come on give me the answer children 
yes correct answer very good children durga puja number 4 a popular sweet of bengal is which is a popular sweet of bengal let's see rasgulla b petha d laddu yes what is the answer the most popular sweet of bengal is rasgulla rasgulla yes correct answer i think many of them like to eat rasgulla yes number 5 bengalis love to play yes which games they love to play a tennis b football and c badminton yes children bengalis love to play football yes again one more they love to play yes that is yeah correct that is cricket very good children understood have you solved this question okay let's see the next question okay now i will erase this question uh, this page let's see the next question what is the next question yes children you are going to think and you are going to answer me yes you are going to think and you are going to answer me okay hots h o t s hots think and answer why do you think kolkata is the only city in india where trains run trains run why do you think this means of transport cannot be seen in hyderabad or bangalore hint kolkata was the capital of the british in india for a long time yes children you are going to think and you are going to answer me the question this and give me the answer okay you are going to think and answer me yes children yes come on tell me the answer yes kolkata was the capital of british for many years yes at that time the british had introduced trains in kolkata and this means of transportation continues to be used even today yes which facility which uh, transport facility cannot be seen in everywhere in every city but only in kolkata that is trains facility why because it has introduced by the british people next we will see enrichment activities of this lesson okay children now number 1 is what children that is speak out rabindranath tagore wrote a number of poems as you know rabindranath tagore has wrote number of poems and stories for children yes recite one of the poems or read and then share one of the story with your class yes children nowadays we are not coming to school yes but then to we can do this activity what you are going to do you may call your friends and you can on call you can say some stories or some poems who wrote by rabindranath tagore and you can discuss with your friends okay children next one is write 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 a short story describing an incident that happened to your friend during durga puja yes you are going to write some short story or you are going to describe an incident that happened to your friend during durga puja here they have gave you the hint he or she gets separated from his or her family in the puja crowd okay when you are going to puja or in when you can see the crowd places some might your friend might have happened this incident that you, they have separated from their parents okay you are going to write a short story on it 
now find out find out about the others indian other indians who have received the nobel prize now one more thing you can do you are going to find about other indians who have received a nobel prize next one art and craft work draw and color a picture of goddess durga what you are going to do you are going to draw and color the picture of goddess durga or create a model of howrah bridge either you can create a model of howrah bridge or draw a picture of howrah station yes what you are going to do in a art and craft work you can draw and color the picture of goddess durga or even you can create a model of howrah bridge or you can draw a picture of howrah station okay next is situational thinking imagine you are in kolkata you just you are going to imagine you are going to imagine that you are in kolkata you meet saurav ganguly what would you like to know from him as you know even suppose you imagine that you are imagine you went to kolkata and you met who saurav ganguly and what would like to know about him yes what you will like to know about him you are going to think and you are going to imagine role play ask your teacher to tell you the story or show you the film kabuli wala written by tagore working in a group and with the help of your teacher write a small play on it the play must have many characters act out play within your classmate this activity we can't do because due to lockdown we can't do this activity okay next one is we'll see the next one that is life skill okay hands on hands on make a poster on the places of tourist interest in kolkata what you can make a big poster you can take a card sheet paper cardboard paper you can make a poster on the places where the tourist interest in kolkata you have seen victoria memorial science city yes kaligat birla planetarium you can stick and you can make a big poster of places of tourist interest in kolkata okay caring now let us discuss about life skill and values let us discuss about life skills and values caring for the needy caring for the needy mother teresa is known the world over for her charity work as you know mother teresa is known the world over for her charity work she started an organization called the missionary of charity in kolkata where she has started organization called the missionaries of charity in kolkata which provides a home for children who are homeless read more about her from the internet what you are going to do you are going to search on internet about mother teresa she is known as a world over for charity work and even she has started an organization called missionary of charity in kolkata which provides a home or a children who are homeless and you are going to find out those information from the internet okay next is you can do a good deed too yes children i think you can do a good did to do you know of any child or person who does not know how to read or write yes children do you know of any child or a person who does not know to read and write you can help her or him to read and write spend some times each day in this task yes children as you know many of them don't know to read and write if you find this such person you can help them you can help her or him to read and write and you can spend 
same times with them and you can do this task in each day okay yes children what is this this is the football is popular in kolkata as we have discussed and the kolkata is only the city in india which still have trains okay understood okay sorry yeah now let's see some worksheet of this lesson yes children let's see worksheet of this lesson that is name the following in name the following an airport yes children give me the answer an airport yes what is the answer an airport netaji subhash chandra bose a bridge rabindrana rabindra setu or vidyasagar setu a railway station in kolkata a railway station in kolkata howrah or sidhar okay and the river which is the river that is hugli and a sweet that is rasgulla or sandish okay now next is match the column metro botanical garden tradition moderate bengalis next column is what a custom being followed for very long time a1 number b not too hot nor too cold c people of kolkata d a park where trees and plants are grown for scientific studies and even underground railway system yes children give me the answer what is the correct answer of metro yes children what is the correct answer of metro yes metro yes children metro is underground railway system second one is botanical garden what is the botanical garden answer yes a park where trees and plants are grown for scientific studies next is number 3 that is tradition what is the correct answer of tradition children that is a custom being followed for very long time next is what moderate how is the climate in kolkata not too cold not too hot not too cold and what is the famous sweet in bengalis that is pe that is people of kolkata people of west bengal okay understood choose the best option and circle eat number 1 the airport in kolkata is named after rabindranath tagore or netaji subhash chandra bose yes children come on give me the answer the airport named in kolkata is after yes that is netaji subhash chandra bose number 2 is howrah station is located on east or west bank of the river hugli yes children yes correct that is west bank of the river hugli number 3 kolkata was the first india uh, first city in india to have an metro or airport yes children give me the answer kolkata was the first city in india to have an airport or metro uh, airport or metro yes correct answer is what metro number 4 rabindranath tagore or vivekanand wrote our national anthem who wrote our national anthem yes give me the answer yes correct that is rabindranath tagore number 5 kolkata has an extreme or moderate climate yes of course kolkata has an moderate climate okay now let's see next question okay which are the major festival that are celebrated in kolkata yes children which are the major festival celebrated in kolkata do as you know do all kolkatas they are celebrating all the festival but we are going to 
write about the major festival that celebrated in Kolkata. Yes, children, give me the answer. Yes, the people of Kolkata celebrated Kali Puja and Durga Puja. Okay. Now, next question we will see. How is the weather of Kolkata different from that of Delhi? Yes, we are going to compare. How is the climate bit different from Delhi? Okay. Who will give me the answer? Okay. Being near the sea coast, Kolkata has a moderate climate. It is neither too hot nor too cold. It rains very heavily during the monsoon months. Delhi is not on the sea coast. So it has an extreme climate. It is very hot during summer and very cold during winter. Yes children, as you have seen, Kolkata is near a sea coast. That's why the climate is very moderate. And it is not hot nor too cold. And it rains heavily during which month? In the month of, yes, who will tell me in the month of which? In the month of June to September, yes. And whereas Delhi is a extreme climate because Delhi is not having sea coast. That's why it is very hot in, hot during summer and very cold during winter. Understood children? Okay. Now, let us see what we have learned. What are the main points we have learned in this lesson? Okay. What we have learned in this lesson? We have learned history of Kolkata. Yes, what is the capital of Kolkata? Yes, West Bengal. And it is, was earlier known as Kolkata. And can you tell me important port? The important port is known as Diamond Harbour and you can ships bring goods from other countries and take goods from other countries from here. Yes and you as you have seen that all the important offices of state government are there in this city and who is working here? The chief minister and the governor of the state work and they live here. Okay. And next point what we have discussed in this lesson about climate as you know being near a sea coast how is the climate in Kolkata it is moderate climate that's why it is neither very hot in summer or neither very too cold in winter and when it rains it rains in the month of June to September and we have discussed about clothes also okay what traditional clothes the, the main they are wearing in Kolkata that is dhoti kurta and paisama kurta whereas women they are wearing sari blouse and salwar kameez. Nowadays you have seen they have changed the main they have changed over the shirts and trousers. Yes, what next point we have discussed about food. That rice and fish are the staple food in Kolkata. Yes, and which are the two popular sweets that is sandish and rasgulla as the most popular sweet in Kolkata. And we have discussed about festival as I told you. Though we are celebrating all the festival, but the most important festival the celebrating in Kolkata is that is Durga Puja or Kali Puja. Okay. Now already we have discussed about cultural also. Okay. The language the speaker the language spoken in Kolkata is which that is Bengali language and even the people they love uh, of art and music and the most popular game played in Kolkata is what. That is football or cricket. As you know, who has wrote national anthem? Yes, the great poet Rabindranath Tagore. He has wrote a national anthem and he belonged to which city? Kolkata city and he got a first Indian Nobel Prize. Yes, even we have discussed about transport. Yes, how is the transport in Kolkata? Yes, you have seen main railway station in Kolkata that is Haura and Sidha. Haura station is located in where? It is located in the west bank of river Hooghly. And Haura is also known as Twin City. Yes, and this Haura bridge that is Rabindra, Rabindra Setu and the Vidya Sagar Setu connected between these twin city and Kolkata was the first city in India that have grow have an underground railway system called metro and it has an important means of transport in the city and you can still find trains and double decker bus in the 
city and the airport in kolkata is named as what the famous the famous freedom fighter that is netaji subhash chandra bose and even we have discussed about industries also as you have seen there are several industries in kolkata like jute textile paper rubber yes these are the important industries in kolkata and even we have discussed about the tourist attraction in Kol kolkata where we can visit as you know it in the heart of the city you can see fort william victoria memorial the birla planetarium science city kaligat indian botanic garden yes alipur zoo rabindra Sar rabindra sarovar and belur mat are the some other places which attract tourists to kolkata and as you know the national library the biggest library in the world in india is in kolkata as we have discussed in previous session also as you can see this is victoria memorial yes and this is belur mat and it is how how it has built it is built with the unity of that is hindu christian and islamic okay it is a beautiful place once you visit to kolkata you don't forget to visit belur mat okay as what you have learned in this lesson that kolkata is the capital of west bengal kolkata has a moderate climate kolkata has a major port called diamond harbor kolkata has an underground railway system called metro the main language spoken in kolkata is what bengali yes children in this lesson we have learned so many points i think you have understood this lesson yes children what you are going to do again i am going to give you the homework you are going to read this lesson once again wherever you find the hard words you are going to read those words again why i am telling to read those hard words whenever you are writing any answers that time you won't make any mistakes while writing spelling if you will make mistakes while writing spelling your marks will be deducted that's why you should know the correct spelling that's why i am telling you to read the lesson again and again to read the hard words again and again okay children till that time Thank you bye bye see you